headed to my house, um, meeting my wife and Einstein dog training to talk about, uh, I guess it's a consult on uh, further training for Yeti. So here's here's our here's a routine. When we go to bed, Jen brings him in bed. <laughs> well, let's just be honest. Let's be honest. The last two nights, he's barking all day and night. Well, one was the wind. True, that could have been. One time he puked three times <laughs> in his gray. Come on. Oh man, it's nice. Huh? Look at, he always does this, he'll walk with the leash in his mouth. Uh -oh. Okay, I feel it. A little bit? Yeah. That's 11. And it goes to 100. I'm going to go up a little bit. This is 13. <laughs> okay. A little stronger, but not much, right? Yeah. There you go. Okay. <laughs> I'll feel too. <laughs> it's more the anticipation of thinking right. it's going to hurt than it right. actually like See, like this freaks me the hell out. <laughs> so that's 17. But that's better than shocking, right? So, well, it's not a shock. Now you want to go in your crate? Heck no. <laughs> I'm doing great. I wondered, you're, I, I figured you're at lunch again, so I said you're either a really good businessman or you just eat way too much. So we're down here in Brighton, getting ready to visit with uh, Michael Fogeth, who uh, I've known quite a while, sold a home for him, but ironically ran into him. Well, I knew he was going to Gary V in Miami because I helped him get a, a uh, upgraded ticket. He couldn't afford it on his own. And, uh, but I uh, got to spend some time with him in the airport and in the Uber, and so we're just kind of continuing that. He has also uh, hired a videographer, and so, I don't know, we're going to talk about that. We're going to talk about real estate. We're going to talk about all kinds of fun stuff and just uh, enjoy each other's company and learn from each other. This is a score right here. Really? Yeah, this is my favorite. Take them. Well, I'm gonna drink it. Here, let's see. I probably have. There's probably a bunch. What of is this? What a, oh, an espresso man? Man. So every, everything to us is process driven. Get your official coffee cup. <laughs> and I can take that with me. Yeah. <laughs> um, this, this is all. Awesome. Everything client experience driven. Basically. Right. I'm a big believer in you manage to their unique abilities. What are they really good at doing? Yeah. Right. And that's all that we're going to focus on. So if they're good at doing it, let's make sure we do more of that more and less of that the muscle. Well. And if we need something, let's hire a new person to come in and take that all over right. the place. I've, I've learned my time can't be stretched out too much. So I'll only meet with a new client on Tuesdays and Friday, Tuesday through Friday. Okay. My Mondays are today, I call them a buffer day. This is when Catch I get up. to do this stuff, right? right? My, my employees are going to sit with me all day today, every hour on the hour. We have appointments that are booked. I have marketing things. I have, I have webinars I'm supposed to be on, things that I want to learn about, right? That right. only happens on Mondays. So Tuesday through Friday, those are my money-making activities. That's it. One of my mentors says, be where your feet are. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So when I'm home, I need to be home. And that, you know, yeah, that's I mean, a good one. Because the, the, the technology is, is just as dangerous as it is good. Oh, it's right? probably worse. I agree. Those are big things for me that have really helped. Yeah. Just to be able to say, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna separate my time and I'm only gonna do this right now. I'm gonna be the best at doing this yeah. right now. That's it. But they all want to get better. Hey, I want to be able to get better at either what I do or how I do it. Right. So we actually brought in um, Roop Raj, who's a- Not RuPaul. No, not RuPaul, <laughs> not RuPaul. Roop Raj, who is a, uh, a news anchor on Fox 2. And he did a two day training in here on how to do public speaking, how to talk better, what, how you should say things. And so got a lot out of that. So we're gonna do that every quarter. We're gonna do a professional development just for that, of what they wanted, right? Let's forget about talking about money. Tell me about what church you go to. You're right, like, right, like, why, right. why do you like, do you like it? Check right. out my church. I just, everything was great, great, great. great. Why, what caused that? Um, I, I, what caused it for me was I, I actually started getting involved with church more than on a Sunday. Right. And then when it, it, it just, it was my focus. Right, and then and, and I loved the way that I felt and the way that everything was around me. I said, I, I and again, you, you start to hear this thing. You, you know, um, I always just tell me, Kathy Gifford said, you know, if you had the cure to cancer, would you hold it in? Right. No, I, I have the cure right. for everything that you need. So why am I going to hold it in? All right, let's talk about this house. What's your Wi-Fi? Anyway, the house is pretty nice. Um, where, what's going on? Where, where's that family going? They are moving down towards Webster, which is, you know, uh, Washtenaw County. Yeah, horse country. He, he, 
Yeah, he works in Ann Arbor and they're buying a horse farm. A little small horse farm. Yeah, a little hobby farm. Yep. That's awesome. Yep. I yep. like that. I, You know me, with the horse in me, I noticed all their horse stuff right away. I'll get with my people, try to get something inked for you today. All right, cool. So Stacy's working on that now. Right, cool. I'm good to go. Hey, did you tell them oh. about that, the juice cleanse? Yeah, what about yeah I told you, there's one. There's a guy in Brighton. Oh, that's doing them? Sim simply Fresh, you just yeah. you call them up there and do them anytime you want. That's awesome. Oh, I gotta do that. It's, it's so it's like a whole little, like, um, it's like it's a, a mini it's a Trader Joe's, basically. basically. But he has, he he's like a chef, so he does like food and, yeah. I gotta do that. Yeah. yeah gotta, whatever. All right. All right. Thank you. Yeah, thank you guys. See ya. Thanks. Thank you. So we just left uh, Fogoth Financial. Um, big shout out to Mike. That was awesome. Um, I mean, just a beautiful facility. Very, one of the things that uh, stuck out to me right away was, you know, a very systematic but thoughtful approach to how does the client um, have an experience when they come to visit him. And that's definitely something we need to look at and apply to our business. He's done a great job with that. So shout out to uh, Fogoth Financial. Uh, we're now shooting up to Lake Shannon. We're meeting the film crew there at two o'clock and uh, gonna shoot a cryptic video on a new listing that we have on Lake Shannon. Really cool ranch on an acre lot with 110 foot of frontage. So excited for that. That's gonna be really cool. Thanks for checking us out. I love you all. Please drop some comments and tell us what you're looking for. Oh, and today I learned this. This is the water you need, okay? This is aqua hydrate. I don't, I almost sounded Spanish. Aqua, aqua hydration. I don't know, but it says there's a bunch of stuff in here that's good for you. A buddy of mine, Michael, told me about it. If it's good enough for Michael Folgit, it's good enough for John Wimmer. Have a blessed day.